Hello everyone, welcome to another video with Maria Wendt. And today I'm answering the question, how can I figure out where my ideal, where my ideal clients are? So if you haven't already subscribed to my YouTube channel, you can just kind of hover over my profile image. It's gonna pull up a red button that's gonna say subscribe. Hit that button and you're gonna get all of my marketing hacks, my branding strategies, all my little secrets to grow your business online. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button so you don't miss any of them. And let's go ahead and get started with today's video. Basically, today what I'm asking is how can you figure out where your ideal clients are spending your time? The people you wanna work with, where are they online? Where are they spending their time? It's a really common question, you're not alone, and I'm gonna give you the answer. And it's really simple, and it's gonna be so obvious as soon as I say it. The simple answer to this is just to ask them. Sometimes we overcomplicate things and we make it seem harder than it is, but really figuring out where your ideal clients are is as simple as asking them, and you can do this in a couple of different ways. The first is talk to your past, present, and potential clients. Ask them where they spend their time. Are you guys mostly on Instagram these days? Do you feel like you're on YouTube a lot more? You know, just ask them what they're, where they're hanging out in a very conversational way, and they'll tell you, write it down and take notes, because where your clients are spending their time is where you should be. Second thing that you need to do is build it into your business process, build it into the systems that you have set up. So if you have a Facebook group, ask it as one of your Facebook group questions. If you have Instagram, run a poll on Instagram. If you have people book calls with you, build it into the little form that they fill out. You know, it's, again, we overcomplicate this, but if you build it into the systems of your business, you're gonna find that you get a lot more answers because you have those systems set in place. Finally, what you need to do is don't feel the need to be everywhere at once. So you're gonna hear your clients say, yeah, you know, I'm Instagram, I'm on Facebook, I'm on LinkedIn, I'm kind of everywhere. Just figure out where the majority is. So if a lot of people are saying Instagram, that's where you need to focus on. I think online as entrepreneurs, we can feel a lot of pressure to be everywhere at once, but you shouldn't. Focus on one or two platforms and just do a really good job with that. Guys, that's the video. Hopefully this helped give you a little bit of clarity. If you have more questions, drop them in the comments below. And if you want more free advice on how to grow your business, I've got you covered. All you have to do is go to mariawent.com. Guys, it's worth your time to go and check it out. There's all kinds of really good stuff there. I've basically created a huge resource for you guys to help you grow your business and make more money. That's the video. If you have any further questions, drop them in the comments below and I'll see you in the next video.